Officials are expecting record crowds to pack Pier Park in Panama City Beach on New Year's Eve for the second annual beach ball drop. I think it's exciting and I don't know where they're going to put it. Crews will hang the 800 pound glowing beach ball more than 100 feet in the air and it will drop on the new year. 2010 will be an exciting one for locals and visitors to the area. We're one of the few destinations that showed growth in 2009 and we're really looking forward to 2010 with events like this will really help to highlight uh, Panama City Beach as a world-class destination. Soon it will be more accessible to air travelers. Southwest Airlines recently announced it will be providing non-stop service to Panama City Beach and its new airport in May 2010 and Southwest is a presenting sponsor of the beach ball drop. Officials have also provided fun for the kids before the big ball drops at midnight. Crews spent the morning hanging these nets full of these inflatable beach balls. At 8.30 tonight, they will shower kids as part of the family beach ball drop. I tell you, it's all about kids to me. I'm never really worried about my celebration. I've always made sure kids around has always got the good celebration going. There will be plenty of things for the kids to do before more than 7,000 of those inflatable beach balls fall. They'll be able to enjoy bounce houses, street performers, and other family-friendly activities. A mini fireworks display will complete the warm-up act for the midnight beach ball drop to ring in 2010 in Panama City Beach.